Hey, it's Jen at Colchester Pet, where fish are friends. How are you doing today? Today we are talking about water for saltwater aquariums, H2O. Now, um, you know, there's, of course, tap water people use, and they use, and then there's RODI, which is reverse osmosis deionized water. Have you ever had uh, used tap water and had issues with your aquarium? like severe algae outbreaks or losing fish and you don't really know why? Well, that could be because of tap water. Tap water is not the greatest thing for saltwater aquariums. Some people have to use it and that's just what we have to deal with, right? Um, but if you can avoid it, then avoid it because it's not that great. It, ha it causes a lot of issues and, you know, we're in New England, especially in New England, our our well water has a lot of minerals in it that are different than the minerals in the ocean. So fish aren't used to it, corals aren't used to it. Um, you know, a lot of people use salt that's chemically made instead of all natural, which we're not going to talk about that now. But that's what leads to a lot of issues is, you know, we talked about how important rock is. Well, water is just as important. This is where your fish breathe. This is how your fish live. This is like it's like the air you breathe. You want to have the purest and the best air, right? Well, they want to have the best and the purest water. So RODI is recommended. It's reverse osmosis deionized water, and it means that everything has been taken out of the water. It's gone through this awesome filtration system, and you know, all all everything's taken out. So all the minerals and uh, everything and it's called total dissolved solids is what it takes out so you start with very clear clean clear water and then you add some really good salt and that's a recipe for success right that's how you want it and that's you want to start your tank off right it's if you do tap water you know city or well you're gonna have algae you have uh, phosphate and everything and not to say that you can't have that in RODI water aquarium, but it has to be added. And you know, water is the you know second, well, one of the most important things. I know I said rock is the, one of the most important, but water and rock, because water is your natural filtration. Uh, rock is your natural natural filtration, and water is how the fish live. And corals and inverts. So this is an RODI unit. This is kind of like the one we use at, well, like the one we use at the store. And if you have um, well water, you probably don't have enough pressure in your uh, well. So you need a pump, a booster pump, it's called. And that will get you the clearest water. Then you just put great salt in it and you're done. And you start with a great aquarium. So, that's it. The issues with uh, RODI units that people have are, it does waste a lot of water. They're taking out a lot of stuff and it, it wastes, you know, some people have told me that they have a five to one ratio where they waste five and keep one. We try to get to a one to one or a two to one ratio. And that's what deters people from using RODI water. Now. Uh, another alternative is most of the local fish stores, I would think, would carry and sell RODI water that they make. We make ours in the back. I'll show you the setup in a minute. And uh, we have this whole water system that we do to make sure our customers have really healthy tanks. We sell it by the gallon and that's a good way to do it. I mean, of course, if you have a big tank, it's going to be worth it to get an RODI water oh, system unit. And But if you start with like a, a 16 bio cube, a 16 size bio cube, or anything like 30 gallons, 50 gallons, it's going to be a little more money to start, but it already has salt in it. And after that, what do you do? 10, 20% water changes once or twice a month? You know, some people do it every week. It all depends on your bio load and what you're putting in there but that's the, uh, the lowdown on water and why you want it to be RODI or as close to RODI. They also have boxed water at 
you know, the big stores, I like using RODI water. And that's my take on it. So have a great day.